I just did the unboxing and tuned it up. That's all I did. But this is the Jasmine S34C, uh, straight from Amazon Prime. Regularly about 150 to 200 dollars or something they say. Uh, I think MSRP is right around 199. It's December 23rd, 2013. And just kind of want to show you how nicely it comes packaged. You know, they have all their little markings on here. Of course, tissue paper. The the guitar is wrapped up in the, the little cellophane. There's a protector that you can pull off. I'm not going to do it, but you can. Um, he can pull it off when he wants to. And then the strings come wrapped, of course, as well. And uh, they're already on, but they need to be tightened and tuned. And of course, it's uh, it's pretty standard. Let's get a little bit closer of a look at the fretboard. Uh, beautiful fretboard when you, when you see. Uh, you know, there's no big marks or dings or scars in it. Uh, it's very pretty. Um, and I don't remember the specs right off the hand, but I think they were using uh, rosewood for the fretboard. The frets themselves are really clean. They are not sharp at all, uh, which is nice. Oh, just so you know, these are the Diarpeggio uh, Phosphor Bronze Light Gauge 8020, which is, um, of course, pretty nice. Uh, when you go around... The, uh, this has got a, like a small jumbo feel to it. It's an NEX style guitar, so it's a, uh, it's not a dreadnought styling. You'll notice that the, uh, the eight shape, if I can get both of my other guitars in here. Well, either way, you'll notice here that the shape of the eight is kind of elongated, and this one would be a little bit more, uh, a, uh, a little more true to circle, so it's, it's got that Spanish kind of uh, feel to it. It's also nice and deep. You're locking about four inches, four and a half inches deep there. 25 frets on the neck, which is really nice. Uh, things about guitars, especially guitars that you buy that are like a budget. I'm going to set it down so we can see. That really uh, irritate me are the tuning pegs, right? So if, there's, if they're loose or if there's any play in them, it irritates me. Even if it doesn't actually affect the, uh, the tuning, if there's any travel at all, uh, that really bugs me. I don't like them and I usually switch them out. These are beautiful, uh, very tight, very responsive, um, and a very nice slow wind. So you're able to get a very precise tuning. Took me about five minutes to get it all tuned up and, uh, uh, you know, real nice. Um, to kind of talk about the finish, I thought it would be glossy. I should have read this description. I thought it would be glossy only because of the photo. It's actually a matte or satin finish. Uh, I'm actually really happy that it is uh, because... Uh, I prefer those types of finishes unless you have like some kind of flames finish or something like that. The nice part here, here's the book matching. And when you look at it right here, this is the book matching line. And that's a very difficult line to see. It's 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 right here. So the book matching for the top piece uh, is really nice. The top piece is spruce. The other sides, if I'm not mistaken, are uh, no-toe. When we look down again, of course, they cover up the book matching line. But you can see the beautiful striations as they go all the way across. Uh, very pretty indeed. Uh, so my point is that the finish is very nicely done. Uh, the, the guitar came uh, with a very, very nice presentation. Uh, and it came packaged nicely, directly, uh, direct in the Jasmine packaging. Let me just kind of give you a shot over there. Uh, so as you look, you'll notice we got that full Jasmine packaging, as well as, you know, serial numbers and all that other stuff. You can attach, of course, uh, your guitar strap to it. You've got an offset strap there, and then you've got an offset strap button there. Now, this is the S34C. Uh, we'd like to kind of turn around for just a second and give you the opportunity to uh, hear it play.